Hello and welcome uh, to my channel, everybody. Uh, for those of you watching the replay on Twitch, I thank you very much for stopping by and checking this out. For those of you watching on YouTube, I also thank you for stopping by and checking this out. Um, if you've been watching my channel for the last uh, week or so, um, I was playing Manhunter and I beat it and had so much fun with that game. Um, I decided uh, to go back and play another game from the same developer, an older game, uh, circa 2011, I believe. And I remember this, I think it was September 6th, and I remember that because it was the day I found my cat, uh, and I rescued her from a rainstorm uh, as a kitten. So uh, it was the same day I got this, so I remember that. I believe it was September 6th. Might have been September, yeah, it was September 6th, I think, 2011. Um, anyway... Uh, so I decided to go back and play Dead Island. Now, back in the day, I had a hell of a lot of fun playing Dead Island. Um, it's been forever since I played it. I probably have a save on here from God knows when. Um, well, I did fire up the other day to make sure everything works, but I did have a save on there from, like, 2017. Deleted that, played it just for a couple minutes, made sure everything was working, getting ready for the stream don't want any uh, technical issues or what have you um, but we're going to start over fresh from the beginning uh, for anybody who has not played this game or has not played it in a long time uh, so yeah so that's what we're going to do now I'm going to I do have a controller here and that's what we're going to do That's not what I wanted. Not that. Hmm. Okay. Well, apparently it doesn't want to switch over from the keyboard and mouse. So we'll do that. And then we'll tell it Xbox controller. And da 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 da. I don't know what the hell digital fighting type is, but whatever. Uh, yeah, we'll put vibration on that, I don't care. And... There we are. Now it's working. Okay, so. Uh, ooh, hey, Red Panda, nice to see ya. If you can't bet, trying to get ready for another video. Oh, okay. Hey, no problem. Uh, best of luck to your second interview. I hope you do well. Hope you, hope you get what you're going for. Uh, we'll be here when you get back. I'm sure. Um, I'm probably not going to. Um, I am probably not going to uh, stop playing this for a couple hours. So. Uh, that'll be good. And heads up, at 4 o'clock today, Eastern Standard Time, uh, for those watching live, uh, the last um, the last uh, video, uh, the, the final chapter of my playthrough of Maneater, uh, will be posted on YouTube today at 4 o'clock Eastern Standard Time. So if you want to see how it ends, and you're uh, watching this on YouTube, not on Twitch, uh, if you missed it, it's there. All right. Moving on. So we're going to delete this. New save. Okay. So we have some characters. Uh, we have Logan, who is like a football star or whatever. Um, he's really good at throwing stuff. Uh, and doing massive damage while throwing. Uh, I've never been him at all. Uh, here we have Perna. She's a firearms expert, so she's really good at shooting guns and such. 
Um, guns don't really come into the game until like chapter two or act two. So uh, her her firearm skills are kind of wasted in the beginning, but when they come into play, uh, they're good. They're good to have. Uh, here we have um, uh, Zion, Zian, Zian. I'm not quite sure. I, I'm pretty sure that's pronounced with a Z. Um, Anyway, she is a sharp weapon expert. She likes bladed objects. This is the character I usually am, uh, because I like going all slice and dice and shit. So, there's that. Uh, we have Sam B. Uh, he likes blunt objects. Um, he excels at that. I've never been him before. And then over here we got this Ryder guy. Now... Uh, I've beaten the game a long time ago. I know this was like an extra character... Uh, who had something to do with the ending. I kind of forgot. I don't know what his deal is. Um, I believe he came into... Uh, I think he came into play really much on Riptide, which was like... Uh, Riptide was like Dead Island 1.5 or something. So I don't know what his deal is. So I'm just going to pick her. My father was a very great man. A chief inspector for the Hong Kong police. Even though he died when I was 10, I remember him very well. He was killed by an enforcer for the Wo Xing Wo Triad. And I told myself then that I would follow in his footsteps and honor his memory. He taught me martial arts, and I continued to practice after he was gone. After finishing at the top of my university class, I joined the Hong Kong police and was chosen as part of the first all-female anti-organized crime squad. I worked hard. I did my best, but the men in charge never intended to put us on the front lines. They didn't train us the way they promised they would. They didn't believe any of us women were up to the task. We were only for show. Instead, my superiors sent me here, to this resort, to this front desk, to be an informer, to spy on wealthy Westerners. My father would not be proud of me. This work dishonors his memory. I will do as they ask, for I am a patriot. But I know I am capable of much, much more. I just need the opportunity to prove myself. Yeah. So, we're going to do new game. You've already completed the prologue chapter. Do you want to play it again? Yeah, I like the prologue chapter. Waking up in a haze. Medium mid kit. So, I wake up in a hotel room. And everything's gone to hell and back. So... Find the emergency staircase. Ooh. Let's take a look. So in this game, if you don't already know, you kind of want to just loot and find shit. Uh, money so you can buy stuff with people on the island things that you can put stuff together to make more weapons um, you'll find luggage to loot everywhere like a ton A 
wire. Uh, six bucks. Okay, so if I want to break open a door, this kind of thing is here. So you want to try and get the red, the you want to try and get it in the uh, red zone. Boom! You get pretty good points. You get pretty good XP for that. Otherwise, if you don't hit it in the red zone, you're gonna keep bashing up against that door over and over and over again until it gives way, and that takes time and it makes noise and. Uh, it's just so much easier if you just do it on your first shot. This is Hotel Emergency Broadcast System. Please leave your apartment immediately. Follow signs to the nearest Maybe there's something useful. Okay. Shit. Got some soap. More money. This is Hotel Emergency Broadcast System. Please leave your apartment. Can't find the stairwell because it's barricaded, so I'll take the elevator. Which you shouldn't do in an emergency situation. You just shouldn't, but in this case. That's kind of all there is. Open that up. Through the camera. Feeling all right, mate? No shakes? Fever? Chills? Good. I'll introduce myself later. Right now, we gotta get you the hell out of there. Do exactly as I say, okay? You're gonna have to trust me. First, you need to get hold of a weapon. Search in the maintenance storage room by the end of the corridor. I would move if I were you. Now. Okay, crouching. I know he tells me to kind of move my ass, but there's all this Maybe stuff to collect. Inside. All this good luggage to just loot and ransack and scavenge. We'll call it scavenging. Because we need, we need this stuff. You know, what am I supposed to do without 81, wow, 81 dollars, or ooh, 23, 6, look at all this money, 9 bucks, gonna need more than that coming to this place. So we got some corpses there, I'll just take their money because they don't need it. Some more luggage, 5 dollars. Run! Oh. Run for the storage room! I gotta run. Just a beast father!
Okay. I'm doing it. No! Didn't oh, I oh, tell you? Oh, oh, stop! Wait! Hey! Can you hear me? Do you understand what I'm saying? Nod your head! Nod your bloody head! I ain't asking you again! Oh, thank God. I'm a doctor, not a bloody executioner. Do you know how close we came to bashing your head in? Why don't you do something? There's nothing to fucking do. You can't just let him die out there. He saved your life. You owe him your life. You going out there? Are you nuts? You're not gonna help me. Get the hell out of the way. You at least have a weapon. You need to find a weapon. Please. He's the only one protecting us. I have an oar. Right. This is fucking crazy. On three. One, two, fuck it, three. the last one okay then thanks mates act one are you there hello can you hear me Shit. hello we were just attacked Listen, your friend from the hotel's awake. You were right about him being immune to this thing. If it wasn't for him, we wouldn't have made it. Maybe now we can hold out until help arrives. There is no help. This thing can't be stopped. I saw how it took my wife. You need to get out of there, and I can help you. I can arrange for transportation. By air, by sea, but first you need to get here. To me. I have many sick and injured here, mate. They're crazy with fear. Tell me where you are. Where are you? You there, mate? Hello? Hello? Oh, God damn it. We didn't think you were gonna make it. You kill them all. I am stronger. Thanks to you. Okay. So, because this is a RPG, um, I do get upgrades when I level up. Uh, there we go. So... Uh, my character has a couple different trees. Um, Fury, uh, which has to deal with, uh, you go into, like, a blood rage and just, like, murder everything around you. Uh, combat, uh, mostly just blade fighting. You do more damage with blades and what have you. And then there's survival. Uh, med kits are more effective. Uh... I'm Spectre. I'm less likely to attract the enemy's attention. Yada, yada, yada. Um, so, yeah. Now, lockpicking is pretty important. Uh, so, uh, I'm going to work my way to lockpicking first. And then we're going to worry about using blades. So...
Name's John Cinemoy. I'm the head lifeguard here. The voice on the radio told me you were in trouble at the hotel. Said you were resistant to whatever this is. I didn't believe it. But then I found you and I saw the bite marks. You got no symptoms, but <laughs> those aren't love bites, are they? Look, I don't know who you are or how you know that guy on the radio, but he's our only connection with the outside world. We keep losing the bloody signal. We have a monsoon coming. So here's the thing. We need to move everybody to the main lifeguard station. There's an ambulance there and more equipment and a stronger radio with an antenna. I hate to ask, but we can't do this without you. Will you help me? Yeah. So, passport to life. Bring the security key card uh, to the lifeguard tower from bungalow number 11. Difficult to easy, reward 400 XP. And I get the nailed mod. So, yes. yeah. Good. First off, we need an access card to get past the security gate. Mine's in my room. With all the commotion, I forgot to take it with. It's in bungalow 11, by the pools. Take a weapon and watch yourself. You may be immune, but that don't mean you can't die. All right. Oh, but there's another quest back here somewhere. This is the end of the <sighs> Fuck, I should have never Don't listened to Cinnamon. Oh, man, I should have left with the others. Why the hell did I stay here with Cinnamon? I should have listened to Maggie and left with James and the others. They probably found a way out the island by now. Maybe there's still time to find them. If you're out there and you see Maggie and the others, could you let me know where they are? Yes. Yes. Ah, uh, thanks. I'll be here. Cause I mean, you know, where the hell else am I gonna go? I like his shirt. I would totally wear that shirt. Energy drinks. Gives me some health. Now. It's in the book of revelations. All your weapons do have uh, deterioration, so you'll, you'll, when you play this game, you do collect a lot of weapons. So you just kind of just pick up, throw away. There's a there's a broomstick handle. Ooh, you know what? I hate that. Uh, what is it? The turn? Uh, what is that? Uh, I forget what they call it. Maybe I can't. Never mind. Another ore. Pick that up. We got here trash can, another energy drink. And, oh, you can break limbs in this game. So if, like, if you break someone's, if you break a zombie's arm or if you break their leg, they're not going to be using that limb no more. Helps against the really big guys that want to grab you. You can throw objects, like I said. It's I always liked uh, throwing like a 
machete at somebody, running it up, pulling it out of them, whacking them in the head. Oh, got hit. Completely. Yeah, the broom handles don't last very long. Oh, I only had room for two weapons. Okay. Monster in the face. In the face. Whoa. Always gotta check your surroundings. Like so. Always gotta check your surroundings. Never know where they're gonna come from. They do like to gang up. Sorry, Alexa, stop. Wasn't talking to you. My assistant. She means well, but she's very eager to always chime in, asking, you know, what what can she do? And I'm like, I didn't even call your name. Now that ore was down here. Alright, I don't know what I did with it. Okay, well, we'll find another weapon. Yeah, I forgot I can only have so many weapons in the beginning. So I don't know what happened to those other weapons, but... We'll find more. There's something down here I could use. Let's take a look. No, nothing here. Gotta be something. What is this? Energy drink. Alright, well, I could use some health back, I think. Possibly. Feeble crowbar. I'll still take it. <laughs> oh, they do drown. By the way, they do take they do take extra damage when they're submerged. I think that was a crit.
bar here has a ton of energy drinks. Oh. Oh. Okay, we got some more energy drinks. We got canned food. Something that I need to lockpick. Some money. A rag. is going on over oh hey that's what's going on someone joined my game I was wondering what was up <laughs> who is playing right now I don't know not quite sure Oh, it's somebody who uh, is not my level. So we're just going to do this. Yeah. We don't want this. Drop out. Yes. And options. Because I forgot it just kind of. Uh. No, I don't want to uh, be online. Let's go to load last checkpoint. And we're going to quit right now. Yes. Because I don't want people joining my game. Uh, single player. Okay. Unless uh, I invite them. Private slots will have three. Uh, no, we won't do voice chat. But yeah, three private slots. That way in case there is anybody who wants to play, uh, who may be watching, or... Uh, wants to ask to play in a future thing, uh, I can, I'm totally cool with that. Okay. Play. <laughs> this music sounds so much like, uh... Uh, Resident Evil Umbrella Chronicles music. Okay. Let's try this again. Take the ore. Okay, so where does it 
It's like, paddle taken. Okay, well, where is it? What do we have here? Ooh, got some ole uh, oleander. That makes poison blades. Ooh, and we got a blade. Hello. Uh, not like a knife or something. It's like a, I think it's like a saw blade. We'll just go around and attack. Just like that. At least they can use stairs. Kinda. Stay down. Oh. Okay, got the paddle. Can't do that. That requires uh, lock picking. <clears throat> okay, what's my quest? Uh, oh, a side quest. The Lost. and track this quest. do swarm sometimes. Have to try to bottleneck them. Woo! 
okay. We got a bone. Damn, man. Yeah. Okay. Leveled up. <clears throat> All right. So, going down the same road we were going. Uh, let's so life insurance decrease decrease cash penalty on death. Kills gain stamina, which is nice. It is so that way I can keep swinging. Or you're less likely to attract the enemy's attention. I mean, that way I can kind of sneak in and out. Um, ooh, deeper pockets, inventory slots, that's always good. That I can't do these right now, but... Um, I don't... What is needed for this? Like, do I have to get so many in this skill to get this one? I forget how it is. Well, kills get stamina. We'll do this one. Let's see what I know. Eh. Yeah. I'll become a little more uh, stealthy. Now I'm tracking the main quest. The side quest will probably pre present itself at some point. Oh my god! Ooh, that's a red pool. Oh Ted oh B. God. Stevie, what's up? My wife. Fuck my own fucking brother! Jesus Christ! What else could I do? Let him kill me? Why are you looking at me like that? What the fuck do you want from me? I had no choice! Awesome. Getting home from work is awesome. Ooh. Tiring diving knife. Yes. Rusty pipe. Uh, I'll get that recording after I kill the student back. Nope, not that way. Cut you so bad, you're gonna wish I didn't cut you so bad. Yeah. Lifeguard security key card. Some alcohol. Seminoise wallet. Ooh, a recording. This is Roger Howard, 
on a special assignment on the island of Banoi. I'm investigating illegal logging and clear-cutting that's not only damaging the ecosystem here, but costing the people of Banoi billions. I've been told that my life might be in danger as those behind this illegal activity will stop at nothing to protect their criminal enterprise. As a precaution, I will be leaving a trail of recordings wherever I go, so that if something were to happen to me, the truth would still be told. I'm leaving now to meet with an informant who I believe could rip the lid off of this investigation. All right, so I've been this way. We'll go down this way. That knife's almost done. <laughs> this way. Ha! Ah, Jeez, man. Where'd that one come from? Fuckers. Beautiful. For a moment, you can almost forget. Oh, and as the game goes on, there's like a monsoon coming in. So you'll see the weather. You'll see the weather kind of get shitty. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, that, that guy just kind of came out of nowhere. Like, I heard him, but I didn't see him. Golden Beach, more like Crimson Beach, am I right? Thank God we found you. You did it? All right. Thanks to you, we might all just make it. Okay, I got the nailed mod. Which can't really use right now. Okay, you ready to go out there again? I need you to find a lifeguard station and see if it's safe. Can you do that for me? <sighs> Get rid of all dead in the area. Go back. Yes. Definitely. Take the beach. It's the shortest way. We'll come as soon as we know it's safe. There should be a working radio inside. Signal us when it's clear, and we'll follow you. Okay. Uh, all right. So I'm looking for a lifeguard station. Got some nails, another rusty pipe. 
Hey. Time to die. Bonk. Just checking. Knife isn't that great. Weapon. Ah, I'm coming, dude. Shit. Oh, oh this this weapon's almost done. Come on. Sports rental kiosk. Maybe you'll find something that'll come in handy. Uh, okay, so I picked up a cleaver? So seriously, where is that shit? Where is my cleaver? I picked it up. Uh, inventory. Go to inventory. Okay, all this shit's here. I, okay, I remember now. Alright, flimsy homemade cleaver. So, we're gonna stick that here. And the rusty pipe can go there. And we're gonna heal. I had a first aid kit somewhere somewhere maybe I don't guess not so we'll put the alcohol there and I guess we'll drink it which 
didn't seem to do anything that would make me drunk. So that's not helping. Yeah, that's not good. I had a first aid kit from the tutorial. I guess, I guess not. <laughs> Got a cleaver though. Can't hurt to look. Ah, there we are. Health. Yes. And you drink some monies. Some water. Search that computer. Got it. Spiteful diving knife. We'll take it. Nails. Water. Place where I can upgrade stuff. Duct tape. wire looking there ooh steel rod don't know what that does but it's nice so here we can upgrade stuff so this cleaver it does 67 damage this the knife does 54 um i like the cleaver so we can repair it uh i thought the oh we can upgrade so we can upgrade this damage to, yes, we can upgrade again, and one more time. So now, uh, it does a bunch more damage, and we'll even do this to the knife. We can create using the nail mod. So... Base item needed, stick, baseball, bat, anything that's on that list and then you need two nails to make it and we'll create it yes the ripper mod uh needs a few blunt objects and then parts needed i need metal scrap the ripper mod is like a it's like a working saw blade on a stick I always upgrade stuff. There we go. Yo. Nah, I don't want to join anybody. Okay. So we're here. I gotta look for, uh... Still gotta look for a... Uh, lifeguard station. Take down. Some guys run. Yeah, we got runners. close.
Got some bleach. Kind of hear them breathing before they get up. that <clears throat> so I can heal up oh um, yeah I don't have anything to really explode for pain tanks boss here. I remember this guy. Uh, do I have health? Health items? Anything? Where are we? I don't. Uh, oh, here we go. Cool. He's a big guy. I remember I like to break his arms so he couldn't really hit. Well, he went down. Mayday, Mayday. This is Oceanic Flight 1012. All engines are out. Repeat, all engines are out. Ground control, do you read? Mayday, Mayday. This is Oceanic Flight 1012. All engines are out. Repeat, all engines are out. Ground control, do you read? We're making an emergency landing north of the city in the jungle. To all stations, I repeat. Okay, everything uh, looks... Pr oh, no. Repair. Repair. I hate the ones that... I hate the ones that run. I really do. Ah! No!
Oh, my battery died. Forgot there was battery life. I thought there was a lot. Oh no, here it is. Mayday, Mayday. This is Oceanic Flight 1012. All engines are out. Repeat, all engines are out. Ground control. Bitch! I miss seeing the plane fly overhead. Damn it. Thankfully, I'm, I'm quick on the uh, reflexes with the uh, getting them off me deal. It's just, it's left and it's right, but still. Where's the CB? Oh, CB radio is downstairs. I guess not yet. Okay, so I checked out up here. It's kind of a bust. Nothing's really going on up here. CB radio. What is my quest anyway? Uh, Exodus. Good life right time. Get rid of all the. Oh, so I gotta get rid of all the undead in the area. Well, okay. Shit. friend I oh you have a knife I think I have a thing to upgrade, don't I?
Okay. 10% lowers my threat level. Excerpt. Read that later. Um, okay, did I get rid of all the undead? No, I didn't. God damn it. How hard could it be to just drop some undead? So they want me to come up here, and they want me to walk over here. So, I follow this, this takes me in here, oh, there, I'm dumb, there it is. After they set up shop here, uh, we'll, we'll save it, and we will, uh, Unfortunately, it is going to be a short one today because uh, I uh, worked all last night and most of yesterday I was up, so I'm going to go sleep, but uh, tomorrow I'll play longer, and uh, I have all next week. I basically all just shy of two weeks of vacation, so Let's I'm going to be playing this all the damn safe time. Now, thanks to you. This is just a we'll taste. Make it long without food. Help don't come soon. We're gonna have to head to town. Meantime, maybe you could see if anybody needs help. Alright, so where is the save option? I forget, is there even a save option? Honestly, I forget. Does it just save automatically? Fuck. Uh, yes. Ah, maybe it auto saves. Uh, either way. Um, yeah. Panda, are things good? Uh, oh, you know what? Maybe I'll check it out tomorrow. It doesn't matter. Mostly just saved anyway. Like that was the checkpoint. So, uh, so, yeah, sorry, short one today, guys, but this is just kind of a taste, taste of things to come, okay, so, you know, you got your, you got your, your, your licking your lips, you got your chompers going, it's zombie fun, it's an RPG, you bash zombies' brains in repeatedly, it's good times, real good times, um, so, yeah, I want to thank everybody for stopping by today, it's, it's a quick one, uh, but, you know, that's all right. We'll go for the long haul next time. When I'm more rested and I have my beauty sleep. So, guys, have a good one. Enjoy yourselves. And uh, I will see you all next time. Ciao for now, and thanks for coming.